Good evening, everyone. It is May 20th, 3301, and you are watching Late Night Galnet with Giant Robot. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the show. Tonight, we'll be talking about how over the course of the last weekend or so, hundreds of tons of bio-waste have been dumped in and around stations in 78 Ursa Majoris. Now, this system is currently undergoing preparations for President Halsey's arrival as part of her planned grand tour. Now, a group calling themselves the Cannon is claiming responsibility for these acts. Now, for those of you who may not know, the Cannon is a group of like-minded commanders who seem to be fighting for truth about the recently discovered artifacts. Now, I don't see how fighting for truth involves dumping biohazardous waste on unsuspecting people, but that might just be me. But it seems that this is the case for the Cannon, as they are willing to use whatever levers are at their disposal to increase the political pressure on the Federation government to force them to come clean. Though, it doesn't seem like anybody knows what they're supposed to come clean about. It seems like conspiracy theorists, or should we call them conspiracy nuts, are trying to think that the artifacts are some type of unknown new weapon of mass destruction. As if. Though it can't be denied, or the parallels were immediately drawing to Dr. R. Cannon in his recent demands to the Federation government following research into the unknown artifacts discovered to be transported in the Federation convoys. We asked Arcane if he was connected to the terrorist group. He denied any responsibility for the group's actions, but declined to answer any further questions on the subject of his potential involvement. However, Dr. Arcane did have this to say. It's clear we're not the only ones growing tired of the Federation's cover-up over these artifacts. Some of the commanders would seem to be taking a more direct action. Obviously, I do not condone such methods, but I can certainly sympathize with their frustration. In the spirit of seeking to put an end to these disruptive acts, I urge all citizens, Federation, Alliance, and Empire alike, to petition your government to make public any information they have to do with the origin and nature of these objects before these demonstrations escalate. I also appeal to Chief Xenochemist Loren Batar to contact me so that we can pool our resources and research into these potentially related items in the search for answers for the common good of all humanity. Now regardless of your political side on this debate, you can't deny that these radical fecal fighters aren't doing anything except disrupting and hindering the movement for information freedom. When will the canon realize that these acts of terrorism are not only unacceptable, but completely undermine the fight for information freedom that they so very much fight for to begin with? Coming up next, we'll be talking to Chief Xenochemist Liren Batar to get his perspective on the current situation concerning the canon and the bio waste. We'll also be discussing his recent research on the artifact itself. Stay tuned. This is Late Night Gownet with Giant Robot. 